Phil X, man, what's happening? Welcome to Fretted Americana today. Hope you're having a killer, kick-ass day. Um, and if you're not, I've read some comments. Hey, man, I was having a great <coughs> day, and then I saw a Phil X video, and uh, now I feel great. And uh, I can't tell you how amazing that makes me feel, so thanks for that. And uh, let's rock some git. Um, this is a 1961 Strat slab board Brazilian rosewood. So um, it's like a rosewood cap as well, right? Because uh, the they lay the truss rod into the neck, and then they put the cap on top. And this is Brazilian rosewood when they were still using the stuff. It's really hard. It's got a lot of tone. It's awesome. Um, this is a fantastic refin by Jay Black about 10 years ago. As I said, it's a 61 with the refin being done 10 years ago. Everything else is original down to every screw. Look at how look at the discoloration of that pit guard. It's perfect. It goes to that minty green kind of thing that people strive to recreate these days, but nobody really quite does because only age can do that. As well as uh, pickups, right? Old pickups, old wood. It just sounds awesome. This guitar has an amazing funk sound. We're in the, um, the Vox AC10, 1964. Sounds a little bit like this. This is an Aretha Franklin song. Whoa, I'm really going someplace else. Called uh, Baby I Love You. Something goes something like this. Uh. <laughs> Okay, and then uh, that was the neck pickup, and this is the middle pickup. This is a three-way switch. It's got a really cool uh, sound to it. I don't usually, I gotta say, I don't usually like the sound of the middle pickup because it's not bright enough and it's not fat enough. Um, but it's, it comes in really handy when you want to do like a Mar Mark Knopfler or a Steve Ray Vaughan second or third or uh, fourth position in a five-way. But uh, this actually has a really nice tone to it. Look out! Think about That's the tone, man. This is trouble pickup. Hey. Well, they were dancing and singing and moving to the groove and, and just when it ended, somebody turned around and shouted, play that fucking good sick wild boy. Play that fucking good sick boy. Play that fucking good sick wild boy. Lay down that fucking good sick Play that fucking good sick boy. Take your time, mother! Woo! What? <laughs> okay, I got carried away there. It's like I do yes, at times. I uh, didn't quite make it back. But anyway, check it out. Um, man, this guitar has just got like a... Uh, let's try that middle to pick up. Let's try the high pickup. Man, you can do it. Long Train Running by the Doobie Brothers on any pickup on this guitar. And then we 
got. Check it. We never rock out. This isn't really a manly color, by the way. I think it's kind of a girly color. Let's see how many comments we get on that one. Anyways, um, so uh, not, this has nothing to do with this <laughs> at all. But we're going to, uh, um, if you watched, uh, you got another thing coming um, video. I don't know what happened. These guys were using rock guitars like K.K. Downing was using a flying V. And, uh, and Glenn Tipton was using like, um, you know, he was using either a Les Paul or an SG or a Strat with humbuckers in it. And, uh, and then you watch this video and they're both playing like out of the box Stratocasters with single coils. Okay, this is the, the story with the Tone Master. Um, it's not here today. Okay, I'll, I'll be honest, it's out getting fixed because I popped a tube and it did something to the insides. So but anyway, in the meantime, I'm using a 1964 Vox AC10 today. And for our dirty tone, we're going to use uh, a tone box, tone, uh, Skull Crusher which is an overdrive slash distortion box, which is actually a really nice sounding, but it, it's the coolest pedal that's going to be on the market because it's not quite out yet. This is a prototype that I'm using today. Who's that? That's not me. <laughs> Cameraman, phone, loser. Um, okay, so check it out. Um, let's do it. I'm going to try to be, play kind of both parts because I'm only one guy. <laughs> And I'm not going to do the, because I just can't with conviction. And it goes something like this. Oh, now, I don't know the words, yeah. Sound sounds awesome. This guitar. Just... Getting away. What? All right. Thanks, man. Thanks for hanging out. <laughs>